The C-130 Spectre gunship is a formidable weapon in the war on terror. This aircraft is ideal for providing surgical airstrikes for troops on the ground in close contact with enemy forces. With any tool or weapon, special training is required. The Have Ace training program combines aircraft with special operators on the ground and teaches the skills necessary to maximize proficiency with air asset integration. Launching a C-130 and firing live ordnance for every training hour is expensive and creates significant safety and logistical challenges. So how do you safely replicate the effects of a 105 millimeter howitzer. Explotrain has the solution with their full complement of explosive blast simulators. Safe, efficient, and cost effective, Explotrain's explosive blast simulators provide battlefield effects that can be replicated over and over again at pennies per shot. Today, we'll take you to an undisclosed location near Eglin Air Force Base, Florida. We'll put you behind the scenes. Splash. We'll put you right in the middle of a Have Ace night training hour and show you joint terminal attack control, JTAC operators, learning to use air assets. And we'll show you how Explo Train can revolutionize this training. One hundred five stuff. Generally in this area. Generally in that area. I'd like the the twenty five mil to be up there by the straight target. I'd like all the targets to be within five meters of each other. The only exception would be the two on the road. His effects drive, you know, the positive strike from the airstrike. These guys are robot mannequins, which are gonna simulate the bad guys. They're gonna be moving back and forth as sentries when the assault team comes in to take them out. There are a total of six of Explotrain's Harvey wall bangers. These go off in rapid succession when the event takes place. These devices are used to simulate the impact of a 25 millimeter Gatlin gun fired from the C-130 overhead. Over here on this side, you can see we've got one more robot bad guy for this location. But right here in the bushes, you can see an X05 from Explotrain. Now this device gives a louder burst in a bigger cloud, and this is gonna simulate the impact of a 105 millimeter shell from the C-130 overhead. Three additional X05 simulators are hidden throughout the terrain in the vicinity of our enemy robot combatants. This way, any target a JTAC operator selects for airstrike will yield positive effects. testing an X05 explosive blast simulator for simulated air support here on Eglin Air Force Base. Explotrain has finished setting up and testing the devices. The sun's getting low in the sky and it's time to move back to our command post and wait for the night op to start. The road right next to us is Budweiser. So if you hear any of these guys talking about coming down Budweiser, 
Um, we just need to remove ourselves from the scenario as much as possible. Uh, the target building, uh, you guys are all familiar with, is on uh, Route Steel. Corona is near the fire department. There will be an enemy QRF that comes and attacks them from the west. That's going to be the single white technical. It's going to come hauling ass from west to east on Corona. It'll park very close within small arms range, and then he's going to begin shooting. Technically, the scenario has already started. Uh, there's a three-man team on the rooftop of the fire department. They've been reporting all of our movements and stuff and sending it back via SATCOM. Great Eagle, Chaos, we'll have you hit the one closest to the building, so that's your call out. And then I'll hit uh, number two and three, the two guys on the, the road and the dirt. We have a uh, key on the uh, north side of the key intersection, uh, just want to make sure you have eyes on both of those. We're looking at one on the north side and one on the south side. The southern tango is further east. Those two should go first. You know the guys on the ground are starting to go static and they're taking a more offensive posture with their weapons. Eyes on. Doug, fire mission. Yeah, friendlies at the ORP. Target is Northeast Building 8 Bravo, two sentries on the road. I'm zero one copy, is friendly. ORP, target set Northeast, 8 Bravo. I'm zero one, ready to fire. That's your command. Elevation 11 feet, two personnel in the open. Splash. Are they both dead? Yep. Yes. Eyes on. Flash. Flash. Yes. 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 Two dismounts with weapons moving north on the wise road by the slow rate. Yeah, Roger. Golf 12. Two individuals there. That is your target. Ready to fire target one. Splash. I got a single vehicle white lights approaching the town. Like, uh, they hit the they hit the dismount and the vehicle's still low. Hey, see if we can do a re-attack on them. And uh open fire for That's a gauge Splash. Keeping our first responders prepared and ensuring our special forces remain the tip of the spear. Expo Train enhances your training by providing the realism of live explosives without compromising safety. Yeah, target. I see there's a north side of 8th Bravo, single sentry in the open. Request guns. Send it for hammer. Send it for hammer. For hammer. Yeah, I'm going to send it 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 for hammer. Yeah, I